Hi guys, this is Brian from TopOffMyCoffee.com. I'm going to be reviewing the uh, Trudeau insulated desk mug today. I picked this mug up about uh, about a month ago, maybe a little bit more than that, and I've been using it quite a bit over the past month, getting a feel for it, what I think about it. Uh, it's a pretty nice mug for the price, I think. Um, I've been pleased with it. Um, wanted to compare the size to a normal coffee mug. It's a standard standard coffee mug right there. You can tell that it's quite a bit bigger. Uh, it does hold a little bit more on the inside, but as you can tell, as you would imagine, the double wall um, makes it look a little bit bigger than it actually is. Um, <coughs> the way that I've used it uh, has almost completely been uh, for around the house. Uh, if I had a desk job at the office, it'd be perfect for that. Uh, as you can tell, it's got a wide bottom, uh, slightly uh, more narrow top, and of course the big handle makes it unfriendly for most cup holders. Uh, it's perfect for around the house though, um, and uh, in comparison to your standard mug, it's going to keep your coffee hot a lot longer. Now, it's certainly not going to keep your coffee hot like a good thermos or Contigo would, but uh, you're paying two to three times as much for one of those mugs, uh, so it's kind of uh, apples to orange comparison. Uh, I've found this mug to be pretty nice for around the house. Uh, it's got a top that uh, does leak even in the sealed position, but seriously, you're around the house, how often are you going to be just turning the thing upside down? Um, when you're just sipping on it, it does. there's no leaks of any kind. Um, the open position and the sealed position uh, is as simple as that. I always keep it in the open position, that's just me, because um, you know I want easy access to my coffee. It's one reason why I prefer uh, Thermos Mugs Contigo in the first place. Uh, but again, those are different types of mugs. The top um, just comes right off. It's not a screw. It just pulls up. You've got a little rubberized uh, seal there. Uh, the seal can come off for washing. Uh, and uh, I'm embarrassed to say, not really that embarrassed to say, but I've never pulled that rubber thing off. Because it actually feels a little tight, like I might damage it if I was pulling it off. That might not be the case, but that's just the way that I see it. It's really tight on there, uh, but it does give a good seal, so that's one good thing uh, about it being tight. In any event, um, it's pretty decent. I did a I did a test oh about maybe three weeks ago where I put hot coffee from my coffee pot into this mug, this mug, and at the same time, I use this generic double-walled insulated mug, uh, which I've had for years. Uh, it doesn't have a lid, uh, and it's got a plastic interior compared to the Trudeau's uh, stainless steel interior. Uh, coffee went into all of them. The lid was left in the open position. One hour later, I went and I tested the coffee. Uh, I just did the, uh, the lip test. I just took a sip out of them. Uh, nothing scientific. This was darn right cold um, at the time. This was barely warm, and this I would call warm. Certainly was not hot, but it was definitely uh, the best of the three. So that was about an hour of use um, straight out of a hot coffee pot. Um, it easily is better than just a big insulated open top mug and worlds apart different from just a plain old ceramic mug. Of course it is ceramic, or I'm sorry, it's a stainless steel interior. Of course it's got seams. Uh, you wouldn't want to put it in the dishwasher. You certainly couldn't put it in the microwave. Um, I end up washing mine. I usually rinse it out every other day or so. Um, and then when I wash it, I just use my son's bottle brush and just give it a good scrubbing on the inside with the just regular old dish soap. Uh, it's not that complicated at all. The lid is super simple. Uh, so I, this bubbly water uh, 
running through it with a little scrub and, and it does pretty good. So uh, if you're thinking about getting a decent desk mug, I definitely recommend getting something over a ceramic uh, mug with no top. This ain't bad at all. Uh, it's got a little rubberized bottom, uh, no problems with it. And after probably about 45 days of use, of almost every day using it, I'm very satisfied with the purchase. So anyway, uh, that's it for now, and uh, I'll check you later.